seawall and why Lua has divided the community there. Some neighbors want it gone. Other property owners who had it built are fighting to keep it up. Kimberly Speakman tonight has that story. Ho'omana Place residents testified at a city hearing today, saying the seawall that was built in 2014 obstructs access to the beach. Grandview Apartments had the wall built and is now seeking approval from the Department of Planning and Permitting to keep it. There was a significant wave event back in 2014 that eroded away the frontage of that area, eroded away the public access way. There were some emergency measures taken to correct that. Ho'omana Place residents say that the wall needs to be taken down. I guess frustration is the biggest uh, description of you know, how I feel. You know, it's one thing to want to protect your, your own property, uh, and again, I've got no problem with that. But when it's at the expense of the public, of right of access to the, the seashore, that's when i got a big problem about it. The DLNR tells me in a statement it has opened a case on this matter following enforcement proceedings a few years back. The state decided that the property owners needed to get authorizations from the city. Senator Gil Riviere says there needs to be more public input on the matter. I don't believe that they've offered enough of that. I believe today is the first day when the public has had a chance to comment. The Department of Planning and Permitting has 45 days to make a decision on the permit request. We'll follow up and let you know what happens. Kimberly Speakman, KHON2 News.